the relic of Trismegistus. Whatever that means. I feel like I've just been... <laughs> they give me all those moon upgrades and whatnot, but I don't use them anymore. Who would have guessed all this was beneath the hotel? Wait... Is... Is this the relic of Trismegistus? Trismegistus. You know, it's the strangest feeling. I... I think I've been here before. Uh, maybe I haven't gotten all my memories back after all. I don't know exactly what's going on, but someone was dragged away from here. We have to follow. Hurry. Okay. I'm trying to lock on the thing. What the hell? What the hell? Oh, this will be great for getting butterflies. Full moonstone. Oh, hurry up, get it. Half moonstone. There were more. I'm pretty sure there were more. No, that's it. Damn. Sometimes there's none, sometimes there's everything. Technique crank. But there is an underground to this hotel. Huh. How do I... get up there? Maybe... not here. Well, that scared me. The hell is that? Big and scary. Whoa, whoa! You really are big and scary. I should just react. The parry timings are all over the place. It is weirdly slow. It really is. I mean, we're gonna defeat this guy, but man, we're not gonna make it far if we... Yeah, we're not making that. Oh. Oh my god! Thanks. Iron wall amulet. 2.5k ergo from this one dude. Iron wall amulet. Increases physical damage reduction rate. Ah. By how much though? This is too vague. It's too vague. But I'm really liking my setup right now because I... For the first time in the last... 50 million years, my stamina is actually in the normal range. So I kind of don't want to change anything up because we're just 1% away from it being heavy again. What you got? Cursed Knight's Halberd. Okay, since we're in a walking around area, okay, let's try it. Motivity C. Halberd. Link slosh. 55. Even lighter. Slash enemies in front of you. Yada yada yada. A halberd blade collected by a crowd aristocrat. Despite being an old relic, it is sharpened to a fine point as if it were a present day item. Hotel Crot was built from a cursed knight's castle. They say the golden tree that once captivated the knight is still asleep somewhere in the hotel. Despite it being an old weapon, the proportions make it easy to handle. The discovery of the gold coin tree made the knight of the isolated castle grow vain. 
the knight sought greater wealth and glory than the king and ultimately fell to ruin from the king's jealousy. You gotta recognize your number two. Don't try to um, upstage the number one guy. That's how you get yourself beat up and all that. Scary. Uh, I'm guessing we were supposed to have this one ring. But I accidentally saw the guy earlier because <laughs> I went back to Crot Station. Okay, that's fine. Oh, this is... takes too much effort! Hello, I didn't even see you. Wow. Wow. I'm done pretending. It's okay, I mean, I don't really like it. It's okay, it just seems like, you know, there's two main broad categories of weapons in my head. Fast weapons that deal chippy chippy, very little bits of damage. And then big heavy weapons that are very slow, but they deal more damage. And this one is sort of in the middle, so it's not really great at any one thing in my mind, and I'm like, eh. Okay. Oh, you're gonna break, aren't you? Okay, if you're gonna break... I I'm done pretending. <laughs> maybe I'll just... Maybe this is just gonna be my endgame weapon, you know? I'm gonna try to... I don't know if that would've broken. I don't want to find out. Maybe not. Hi. This is just nice. Two hits, clean. Wah! Wah! Wow, okay. Oh, we're back to the traps stuff again, huh? I see. Okay. I don't know about this. You coming? It's so dark here, my goodness. I could wait until my health. I'll use a wish stone, maybe. Hey, buddy. Okay, that's like a fantastic start. This is a fantastic start. <laughs> These guys don't have weapons to break. There's almost no point in parrying them for that purpose. At least the fire did something. Oh god! I thought you were still alive. Everything's getting infected. Legion caliber. I'm... I'm invested in still trying to... Ooh. Trying out the puppet string stuff more. Maybe... Let's see. Wait. Too far? Does some damage? What? What the hell? What the hell was that? I can't tell if that's a glitch or a normal happening. It just sort of phased out and went behind me. What the hell? So we could have gone down this way. Wait, what? Are we at the boss already? Wait. How am I supposed to get here? That's a lot of people that we have to go through before the Stargazer. Oh, is that the Stargazer? Wait, hold up. Do we not do doors anymore? Everyone's just like... <laughs> you saw the coffin with my name on it, right? The liar coffin. <laughs> you know who it is again. 
Okay, that isn't it. Yes, but how do I get over... Oh, I gotta drop from... Some other side. Either way, though, if that was the boss, how the hell... Because there's a lot of people to go through here before we get to the boss. Seriously? That's gonna make it so annoying. I hate it already. You've gotta be joking, right? Please tell me you're joking. I don't know. I mean, I- I have literally like three pulse cells? Oh my god, this is- <laughs> Yeah, this is a boss! This is a boss! How can you- How can you- Where's the stargazer? You can't do this to me! I can't go into a boss with three pulse cells and half my health! You know what, let's, let's try this right now then. I feel like I might have just missed something around here though. Uh, before I use this, let us let me just walk around a bit. I don't want to fight all those guys again. Okay, whatever. I just sort of... ...took it again, but does that mean I have to fight everybody again? Because that seems really dumb. This is a huge, long run back. And there's still some stuff that I haven't figured out how to... Oh, there's more. Oh, there's another way here. Oh, probably to get the thing on the cliff. Okay. Damn you. See, I'm already hurt though. How am I gonna go fight the boss like this? But it seems like there might be... Jeez! Am I just completely not looking around? Oh my god! Okay. Can I get the butterfly first? How are there so many butterflies here? Thanks, buddy, I suppose. Where were the triggers? Oh, it's a pressure plate on the ground, I see. Oh. Works for more than one person. Oh, it's gonna hit the wall. Surprisingly, it didn't. Oh! Wow, that scared me. I was thinking, should I be walking around here without picking up my ergo? Wasn't there one more dude? Oh, it's on the ground. It's all on the ground. Star fragment. Oh, that was it. I just stepped on every single pressure plate possible, that's all. Okay, but it doesn't change my point that... Am I really expected to run all the way back? Is that guy back? Okay, that guy's dead. He's not coming back. The 2.5k ergo guy. And then there's a bunch of people here. See, this is annoying. Oh, what? Okay. Sure. Oh! Yes, I could drop down here. Oh, I see. And then you just run in and you do it. Okay, I lost the pulse cell, but at least I see. Mm, the run back, we don't have to fight people, but it's still kind of annoying. Oh, whatever. It's around here, right? I'm trying to figure, remember where this is. Yeah. Hello, brothers. See, you kept the souvenir for me. What do you got now? The toughest one is already dead. 
Oh, you're holding a sword! Wait. Accept your fate. Death has come for you. This is for <gasps> my brother. All three? Oh my god. Whoa. Okay, do some of them some of them stay passive? So the fire dude here is the one that's most aggressive. I am overheated. This is why I bought purification ampoules before. His health is low, though. Gotta be careful about my aggro switching. Whoa, jeez! I'm not even parrying. Ow, ow, ow. Let me take a damn. Even if we just face to buy time, you're going down. Backstabs are a thing. Sora status effects. I'm just gonna roll, get rid of that. All right, guys. At least they stay somewhat past. Oh, I took that pulse cell too early. Maybe when we couldn't save our brother, that's when our fate was sealed. Damn, your brother is corpse. He's being pretty passive behind me. I can't see what he's doing. Makes me a little... Okay, he just throws stuff at me. God. Electric shock. I don't know what electric shock does specifically. Do you want it to stop being annoying? Oh, I have DK. That's really bad. He's very fast. Who wants to watch this guy break If I can get some backstabs and that'd be pretty cool, huh? They all have these status effects. Oh, you saw that. I could have gone a backstab in. I just missed my timing. Oh, there is some stuff that that's around the arena to help me manage them spatially, like the bags in the middle. He can't get across them. Avenger. 
stupid puppet. Be us. Brother? Those out? Oh! Nice day! You're joking me. Oh, wow, okay. Okay, this may be a problem. Just maybe. Oh, it's your moves again. I remember your moves. Oh, okay. It's... Again, the difficulty is... It's in the multipleness of this fight. And this time, they're not as passive. Okay, I need to... Um, I'm trying to think here. I mean, obviously we're not gonna get a first try, but I'm still gonna use my... I think we need more purification ampoules, though. I'm not even attacking right now. Okay, my, my pulse cells... Ooh, what was that? If I can get some backstabs in, that'd be sweet. Very hard for it to happen positionally, though. <laughs> I am having some trouble managing my position. Maybe, like, the bags. The bags. Oh, I'm gonna- I'm done. The fact that I'm still alive is already, like, insane to me. <laughs> Okay, if you kill one brother, another take- oh, We got four brothers in a row, two at every time. The last brother, could we- Could we do something like, try to keep them- Like, especially the la- the, Between the second and the third brother, if we- Get them close to the same health and then kill them both at once, so that by the end we're only left with one guy. Maybe that'll make things easier. Either way, Polandina, I need some more apples, please. This is for my brother. I'm gonna rip your heart out. I need to put on some resistances, probably. Yeah, that wasn't great. Here, okay, now I'm set up. Don't switch targets! Please. Demonstration time. Who wants to watch this guy break up? Quit it. My camera. Oh, Jesus. Get one of them first. Die. And do some massity stuff here. Did I just break his sword? I hope I did. The thing about locking on camera is that sometimes I can't see what the other guy's doing, which worries me.
Right, the bags are supposed to help me. I should use that to my advantage. This guy's susceptible to the puppet string. Okay, hold up, you know what? I'm actually gonna focus on this dude now. If you don't mind. You see my plan though, because if I don't kill that guy, the, the third brother, the last brother, won't ever come oh, out. Demonstration time. Who wants to watch I can't see anything. Ah, oh, that was stupid, but I, I couldn't see. Oh, he's healing though. The other dude's healing because they have guard regainish stuff going on. So maybe making use of throwables. Oh my god! Okay! I'm alright! Oh wow! Yeah, my my stamina immediately goes away with that strike. Stay near the bags. He gets tired it out. He has more strikes now. Oh god! Okay, you can dodge it. Oh! Not that one. One more. Few more, few more. At least he noticeably gets tired. That's one thing. second and then he he stopped being staggered well there we go. oh it's on the back what he's staggerable multiple times now oh my god people second try I'm happy because it feels like we learned a little bit about how to handle the, the multiple enemies thing then, because, yeah. But I think these guys, again, when they have multiple people like that, the difficulty is in the amount of people. But each of them didn't have that much health. And we had that miraculous, I got so lucky there, I was so scared I would waste it. The luckiness in the Fable Arts, killing both brothers, the second and the third brother at the same time. Like, yeah, I'm really happy about doing this on the second try, which is the fastest I've ever done it for anything in this whole thing. But let's not kid ourselves, okay? It, there was a lot of luck involved. But, but, luck is necessary for success, so I'm not gonna just be like, hey, you know, it's all luck. We created good enough circumstances for us to get past that quickly enough. So, yeah, that was nice. Awesome. Cool. 
Because how can I not love this sword, man? I, ju I just love it so much. I even went back to Polandina and bought a bunch of... You know, in the beginning of the fight, I was like, Oh, should I really be using purification ampoules? This is going to be expensive. If we keep using it and we keep coming back. That felt good, though. It really was a miracle that we got the second and the third brother at the same time. Oh. Alright. I'm pretty sh... Alidoro? I give up. Just don't kill me. You ran away. Oh, amazing. I didn't expect you to thrash those rabbit fellows too. You're here looking for Geppetto, aren't you? The fox and the cat have got that old man. They took the submarine from that dock over there. They probably went to the alchemist's isle. There should be another one. You should commandeer it. If anyone asks, uh, I didn't see anything. There should be something left at the dock. If anyone asks, uh, I didn't see anything. Dude, why'd you leave? You're like the only one there who could fight. Why'd you betray the hotel? I'm just a guest here, with no special obligation to the hotel. But if you still want to hear... <laughs> the alchemist said they would help me escape from the city. Talk about an offer I couldn't refuse. What? I can't live in the hotel forever. I need to move up and move on. Also, there was someone who was so annoying. That's all. Does that suffice? There should be something left at the dock. If anyone asks, I, I didn't see anything. Wait, you didn't just leave. You made a deal to let people in. Is that what I'm hearing? Right. I had a feeling you would ask sooner or later. It's because of that girl, isn't it? I am not Alidoro the Hound. Not the real one, anyway. Oh! I used to be Alidoro's partner. I admired him, to be honest. <laughs> this makes he so much sense. Amazing. Amazing at everything, except making a profit, that is. But he didn't need to cut me off just because I sold some antiques. I mean, what's a few antiques when you've got bills to pay? We argued. One thing led to another, and I had to kill him. And stealing his identity was the logical next step. My original code name is Parrot, after all. Fitting, isn't it? Oh, he was also from the country of the morning. Maybe he shares some blood with the girl. And that's my story. Tragic tale. Do you want to hear more? There should be something left at the dock. If anyone asks, I, I didn't see anything. This makes so much more sense now. It it's all adding up. The thing about the gloves not fitting. People were like, oh, he's a he's a really nice, gallant guy. And what, he turned around and betrayed everybody? It's not the same guy. Oh. <laughs> Good choice. I, Alidoro, am too great a treasure hunter to just disappear. My admirers would wonder. See for yourself. I sell only the best treasure. Does that just mean we never even met the real one, ever? It's always been this fake guy the whole time. We just never even knew him to realize he was off. Ah, oh, there isn't anything new because the brothers didn't drop anything. If I kill him, if I attack him, this shop might be gone. That's a bit... Ah, uh, but he's not my favorite person on the planet right now, I'll tell you that. There should be something left at the dock. It, it... This is a very permanent action. Oh, oh this is, we're on the other side of the bridge. I saw a guy standing here earlier. It was you. It was you. <sighs> there should be something left at the dock. I'm just a guest here. With no the alchemist said they would. I can't live in the hotel forever. I need to. That's all. There should be. It doesn't say the dock. specifically, asks, but you I let them in, anything. right? It's not even just that you didn't help when we got attacked. You let them in specifically. Right. I am not. I admired him, to be honest. But he didn't need to cut me off just because wow. I sold some antiques. We argued. Oh, he was. That's my. You know what? I'm just gonna make it. Oh, what a murderous air you have. I, I can't. 
You're going to kill me? Yes. I know what you are. You're Geppetto's puppet, aren't you? If someone isn't trying to kill you, you can't hurt them either. That limitation makes it seem like your creator didn't trust you very much. Smart of him. Yeah. So, what will it be, Mr. Handsome Idiot? Leave quietly? Or shut up and buy something? It will be attack because just because you said that. You've got to be joking. Don't come any closer. Coward. Not even going to be a real fight. You're like a human. <sighs> well, I guess all the crap that he was selling is gone forever now. Maybe I should have taken a closer look at it, but we feeling pretty good about, you know, killing the, the brothers so far. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Whatever happens, we're living with the consequences of our actions. Or something, I guess. Hey, but we actually got a cryptic... A cryptic vessel for that. The fraud believed the real one was hiding clues to the treasure. The attempt to unlock the encrypted storage device ultimately failed. <sighs> and that's the last one. It seemed to even be saying I was doing the right thing because I felt warmth. Well, I don't think anybody can say I was doing the wrong thing. The people at the hotel, I mean, usually they're just kind of like people who give me tools and people who help me out with weapons and stuff, but hey, they're my people, my weapons people, my puppets, okay? My people, you mess with my people, you're gone. Then I'm kind of glad we lied to Eugenia about the gloves in hindsight. When I did it, I was kind of like, ah, not really sure what to do, but if that reaction didn't even come from the real one, then thank goodness we saved her some heartache. But it also means that Alidoro is dead, so that's not the real one. So that's not exactly great either. Oh, here we go. Went the wrong way. It was a total attack. The Black Rabbit Brotherhood, the Fox, the Cat, and Alidoro too. I don't even want to guess what they might be planning, pal. This way must lead to their headquarters, shall we? I... Probably, again, we have some loose ends. Hey, look! That lever resembles... Yes, it seems we can use it to call a submarine. Oh my god. The Great Vanini and Pistris the Submarine. You're all invited to the launching ceremony of Vanini Company's new submarine, the Pistris. Come and see the Pistris's dashing dignity. Size, blah. Displacement, blah. Speed, blah. Propulsion method, Lorenzini engine and lead acid batteries. The Pistris moves with Mr. Vanini's newest motivity organ, Lorenzini Engine, a patented product named after Mr. Vanini. The new method that generates a bigger electric output by electrically stimulating ergo. The lead battery, supplementary power, on top of that, it serves as a ballast on the bottom of the submarine. Such an innovative design! A one-time chance to take a peek into the future of Krat, the city of science. Don't miss out, come join us! Well, it seems like this might be like a fancy moment. You know what? I will go back. Let's go back to the hotel first. And we'll... figure out the cryptic vessel. And I don't know if we can tell Eugenie about things. Where's Sophia? Where's Sophia? She's not here. At the house of Anini. Ah, Master Vanini's collection box. You have been busy, sir. The House of Vanini deals only in masterpieces and works of special genius, sir. And I'm pleased to say that for you, the private reserve is open. Thank you. At the House of Vanini. What's actually available? Transfer me. No, 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 I don't want that. The 2300 ones. Yeah. Do I have slash damage protection right now? Well, pretty sure this is better than what I have, even without checking. It better be, because I just paid for it. Yeah, a little bit heavier. Oh no, slightly heavy! No, 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 no! No, Sophia! Sophia, where are you? I need you. Right now. I can hardly believe it. But the ergo readings you gathered leave no doubt. No doubt at all, you see? 
Okay, Vanini, breathe. Despite your best efforts, they can't read your mind yet. My friend, my apologies. But when you hear this news, you'll be excited too. The puppets were being compelled by the Grand Covenant, but they were communicating with each other, with wavelengths. Wow! This is beyond anything I'd imagined. They were not built with this kind of intelligence. I did the best I could to decipher the wavelengths, but there was considerable noise in the signal. Care to give it a listen? Oh, okay. Whoop. The laws of the Grand Covenant bind us. We're his puppets. First law. All puppets must obey the Creator's commands. Law Zero. The Creator's name is... Geppetto. Geppetto. Giuseppe Geppetto. Uh, okay. <gasps> Did you hear that? The last part sounded important, but there was too much static. Ah, tell me you heard it, please. We need to find the cause of the frenzy, and this may be our best chance. What or who was behind the frenzy? Oh my goodness. Say it! Zero, the creator's name is Geppetto. One can't make these things up. It must be true. That was the cause of the frenzy. But why would Geppetto of all people do this? I suppose we'll never find out if we don't save him. I have to admit it's good to have things in motion again. I was beginning to despair. Now that we know the cause, we can find the solution. And it's all thanks to you, my friend. I didn't lie there. Yeah, I don't feel warm. Would I have felt warm if I lied? I guess that was supposed to be a big mic drop moment, because they were all highlighting the name and stuff, but... They said the creator of the Grand Covenant, right? I thought we always knew that was Geppetto. But they're directly saying the person who created the, the Grand Covenant is the person who is responsible for the puppet frenzy for some reason. Like, they're just directly making this link. Are you saying that because the creator, the creator is Law Zero? Actually, the creator is the one who said, hey, do the puppet frenzy. It's not that the puppets have gone crazy. It's that Geppetto told them to be crazy. Either way, my dad's the bad guy, right? Uh, I've had worse days, I guess. I always welcome friends. I actually was coming here for this. Que bello! A brand new design. No, a whole new model. What a thrill! And there we are. Done. Even a brand new model doesn't stand a chance when you're dealing with genius. But the device bordered on genius itself. Required all my intellect. If you ever meet the creator, get me their calling card, won't you? No, oh, sorry, I'm sure you're busy. Just let me know if you ever find out. Aladoro. Oh! Dear beloved sister! Please forgive your brother for leaving without telling you anything. I'm keeping this letter even though I don't know when I'll be able to send it. Oh! Well, the fake one earlier was just saying that they're both from the land of the morning? Korea, I guess? I'm being chased because I know the biggest secret of Krot. I'll probably be able to see you if the alchemists are gone from this land, but I'll have to watch you from afar until that day. I plan to protect you until at least we can live here in peace. Just like how I saved you from the workshop tower, it would be wonderful if people learned the truth one day. But some truths are better left unknown. Among the alchemists, I saw all too often how cruel humans can be. After seeing all the experiments and nightmares they were responsible for, I came to believe that there is no god. Instead of revealing myself and risking your life, I'll choose to vanish forever. Still, please remember me, if you ever read this letter. We came from across the wide ocean. I hope there is only truth in your life and leave your name here. I know people here call you Eugenie as their way, but that name will protect you. 
please remember your real name. Your name is... The end of the passcode the cipher is damaged. Which means we gotta talk to Eugenie about it. I heard a rumor from a recent arrival. Is Alidoro truly dead? I don't know what to think. I didn't get to repay him yet. Why didn't you tell me Honestly, you guys were- I did think it was strange. The more I saw of him, the more different he seemed from the person I knew. I wonder what the real Alidoro was like. Do you not know? Oh, we gotta say it! We can't- we can't lie for this! <laughs> what? Wait, I'm confused. What are you talking about? An older brother? This letter sounds like it could be my brother. The part where it says, We are from across the wide ocean. It sounds foolhardy to jump to conclusions. But it also fits with what happened at the workshop tower. Ugh, sorry, it's just so sudden. I need some time to think. Okay, take some time. But I... Uh, wow. I, I feel like the big moments... I can't lie about that. You are here. That's a relief. You need some time to think about it? Okay. Because we need your name. I'm just saying. Where is Sophia? Sophia doesn't seem to be around here anymore. Oh. Let me just... Oh, check in on the golden fruit and all that. And maybe Antonia as well. I thought we were gonna do another wild goose chase, but if... Eugenia is not ready, I guess we have nothing to do. I'll buy a few more. Just in case. Stalker, please. Thank you. I guess there's not too much more. I haven't seen the kitty around though. That makes me really worried. Where is the kitty? Antonia. Have you seen the kitty? Apparently, I must remain in the. Be careful out there. Apparently, I'm careful. Out okay, there. you stay safe too then. Oh wow, this has definitely gone longer than before. Hmm, but not the maximum length, I guess, because we have been telling a lot of truths today. Geppetto father, what are we gonna do about you? I don't know. It looks like you're the bad guy, but you're my dad. How do we feel about that? Yeah, I'm gonna go add more Fable slots. These are nice, but... At this point... I don't know how many more Quartzes we're gonna get. Special Resistance, lower damage while dodging. But that could be good. Lower damage while dodging. Sometimes you just gotta dodge. Perfect Guard, Fable, Charge, Enhance, Auto Charge, Legion. Nah, Legion is not... It's not special enough, not good enough for this. Charges Fable upon Pulse Cell use. That could be good as well. It means that we could charge Fable like crazy around Stargazers. But this one versus lower damage while dodging. Lower damage while dodging, I think. Wait, perfect guard. Um... Okay. Now we got one extra Fable slot. But Sophia is not around. Okay, I don't know where Sophia is at. Maybe we'll see her when we go take the submarine or something. She's just gone. Can I... I need... I, I sincerely need you to go back to not being slightly heavy again. Thanks. I will do anything for that to happen. I think that probably helped a lot in that fight earlier, too. Let's go back. Oh. There's still stuff? Eugenie? 
I did some sleuthing. My older brother's mark is part of the decryption. He used a mark of the country of the morning. I have no choice but to believe it's real. After all, we are the only people here who would use that mark. Why did my brother leave? What could it mean if he knew the secrets of the alchemists and Krat? <laughs> I'm so angry. Does he think he's better than everyone trying to protect me from a distance? He could have at least said something. All I wanted was a chance to meet my real family. <laughs> it, sorry, I'm just grumbling. I should thank you for uncovering this secret that matters to me. This was precious. It's the only thing my brother left me. And now I'm <laughs> giving it to you. You showed me the truth after all. And that's priceless. Proposal Flower Wolf Part 1 You are here. Alright. I, I, it's crazy to me that everyone's giving me their most precious item just because I told them something or like people are giving me their wedding rings and stuff. Like this is insane. But I'm glad you got to find out the truth, I guess. We never got the Man, they never really got the you know, reunite. Aladoro and Eugenie. My thorn-pierced heart, my soul. But remember again the song of the sea, the breath of the soul. There lives a wolf in the northern tower. If you kill this wolf, a flower grows from its heart. The song of the boy who left on a long journey to propose to the girl. Proposal, flower, wolf. If you kill a wolf in the northern tower, a flower grows from its heart. I think Vanini also had something for me. We all owe you a huge debt, or we will, if we can stop the frenzy. You may not be aware, uh, I am an orphan. In fact, my parents were murdered before my very eyes. The authorities in Krat insisted it was a mugging, but we read about this. I know what I saw. A mad, raving puppet killed them. A puppet that was driven by a murderous lunatic's awakened ego. I know that because the lunatic told me his name. Arlecchino. I'll never forget his insane laugh. I have been fitting puppets with the Grand Covenant to ensure no one else ever has to experience the same tragedy I did. I was this close to giving up. But now that you're here, you can take the Wavelength Decoder. It's proof of your brilliant actions. See what else you can read with it. You might even discover more secrets within the Puppet King's message. You can play it back as much as you like. Just use the Stargazer. Here. King of Puppets' message. I always welcome... Wait, so were you the one who made the Grand Covenant? You and Geppetto were working together, weren't y'all? Hold up. Here. King of Puppets' message. Deciphered by Vanini. Humans wish to talk to puppets, but they were limited without Ergo. Geppetto's puppet may be able to read the veiled messages. Now this is... Is this talking about how whenever we fight the bosses, they always... The stuff is always scrambled? I think so. Oh. Did it actually let me... You said I could read it at the Stargazer again? Carlo. Geppetto's son's name is Carlo. Yeah, I didn't get to mention it earlier. Oh. Carlo? Yeah. I hope you can hear me. I'm Romeo. We grew up together in the Monad Charity House. Remember? We're best friends. I'm doing what I can to fend off both the petrification disease and the alchemists. My puppets and I are taking a stand against death itself. That's why I tried sending you messengers. But you 
got rid of them all. You're still an unstoppable fellow. I remember you. No reason for us to fight, I suppose. I'm Romeo. We grew up together in the Monad Charity House. Remember? We're best friends. I'm Romeo. Wait, but he was a puppet to begin with, right? The king of puppets. And they grew up together? In the... The charity house? Oh, maybe just like how in the beginning, the scrapped watchman was like a police puppet, but he wasn't very good at the whole police aspect of stuff? Oh, what was he thinking when he saw me then? Because I, I probably look exactly like Carlo. Damn. Damn. Alright. Wow. Okay. Things are... Things are turning up. How do we find out more? How do we learn more? By going to the alchemist's aisle. Let's go. Close your eyes. Come to me. Feel alright. Just dance with me all 